Hello everyone, hope you're fine and doing great. Welcome to Elias Tech channel. If you're new here, welcome and don't forget to subscribe my channel as well. Today I would like to talk about one of the most important topic that I believe most of you are confused. I don't mean the technical people, but it is for non-technical people as well. Because the confusion is between megabit and megabyte. If you ask someone, tell me the bandwidth of the internet that you have in your office, sometimes they said, you know what, we have a 200 megabytes internet. Or if you ask some of the non-technical people, they are a little bit confused, or I can say they are a bit confused about to say megabit or megabyte. So that is why today my topic is what is different between megabit and megabyte top of that how to write megabit and how to write megabytes because it's very important from technical standpoint from technical standpoint we are using megabit and with the help of megabit we are measuring the internet and with the help of megabyte we mostly measure the file and the storage it's the main difference between megabyte and megabits let's go with more details and discuss about what is megabyte and what is megabit even i will try my best to give you a good shot about how many of megabit will become how many of megabyte let's get a start one megabyte is equal to eight megabits but the terms are used in specific ways megabit per second we can say mbps lowercase are generally used to describe the speed of an internet connection but megabyte is mostly we are written by mb uppercase usually referred to the size of file or storage or the hard drive which we have in our PC personal computer or in our servers. If I convert 1 Mbps or 1 megabit per second, I will get 0 0.25 megabyte per second. Or if I convert 2 Mbps or megabit per second, I will get 0 0.25 megabyte per second or if I convert 3 megabit per second I will get 0 0.375 megabyte per second or if I convert 4 megabit per second I will get 0 0.5 almost half of the megabyte per second but if i convert 8 megabit per second i will get per second and so on all internet connection speeds are measured and reported in bits as you know that bits is a binary number it is 0 and 1 i don't want to go with more details about what is bits and why we are using bits it is totally different topic it is bright i try my best to record another video for that particular topic but most of the time we specify our internet speed based on bit per second a speed or 100 megabit per second 100 megabit per second and 1000 megabit per second and so on okay i hope the information was very helpful if you think it was very helpful uh don't forget to share with your friend with your family and with your colleagues as well and the last but not least uh, again i will suggest you to i mean it's, it's it's a youtube tradition uh you just need to subscribe my channel you don't have to but if you think it I'm sharing the useful information just go through most of the video that I have shared 
with most of my subscribers with my friend through the social media and until next time uh, stay safe be brave and of course see you next time